Hey everyone, this is Jahangir, your Maths Coach. This question is based on angles, radians, sector and segment, which is also a part of AS level students. So let's just start this question. And the diagram shows a sector ABC. This is a sector ABC, which is a part of circle of radius A and the points DE lie on AB and AC respectively. There are AD and uh, AE such that it's Ka, okay, this length is Ka. Now K is less than one. This is very important condition. Now DE divides the sector in two regions which are in equal area. Two regions in, in two regions which are equal area. Okay, it means this part area one and this one area two, these two are exactly same. It is given in the question. So what are important informations are available? Length, this K condition, and uh, areas, like equal area. Okay, these three are important conditions. We have to uh, use these conditions while solving questions. So A part, that says, for A part, angle is given B, A, C. B, A, C, like this angle is given to us. Okay, so over here we can say, a1 equals A2, which is given to us. A1 is the area of a triangle. Area of this triangle, which we can write half times product of sides, which is Ka times Ka. And then angle between them. So that is pi over 6. Okay. And uh, this A2, we can write area of whole, like area of, suppose we need to write this A2. This A2 we can write area of area of this sector which is 1 over 2 times R square theta. Now here R square is A square, right? Minus this whole minus A1. We have to remove that. So A1 is here. Now we can say um, or you can write A1 again what is a1 half times ka times ka times sine pi over 6 so here we got ka times ka which is k square a square 1 over 2 and sine pi by 6 is again 1 over 2 and you can take this to left side which is plus 1 over 2 k square a square and sine pi over 6 which is 1 over 2 and this part we can write here 1 over 2 a square pi by 6 okay now if you combine or you can take k square a square common so if you take k square a square common then 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 it will be 1 over 4 and here also it is 1 over 4 and this is 1 over 2 a square pi over 6 now a square and a square we can cancel now here it is k squared times 1 over 4 plus 1 over 4 it is 1 over 2 and it is half times pi over 6 now 1 over 2 and 1 over 2 we can cancel k square equals pi over 6 now k is plus minus root pi over 6 now here k equals plus minus we can use calculator to get pi over 6 that is 0 0.723 which will be k plus 0 0.723 because we cannot take negative one why we cannot take negative one because if you take negative one then a a e length will be negative right because it depends on k but length cannot be negative that's why k should be only positive and k should be less than one so we also got less than one Suppose by mistake, if we got 1.723, it means somewhere we have made mistake, which we need to check again. By the way, it's right. Now come to the next question that says for a general case in which angle B, A, C, theta radians, where theta is given to us. Now this condition is given to us. Find the set of possible values of K. So now here, what we can write Again, A1 equals A2. This information is available. So we will write A1 equals A2. And then we will write A1 equals area of 
area of this area of this whole sector which is which is 1 over 2 times r square theta minus this is area of the whole sector and we are going to find only a2 so whole sector minus this triangle right so a1 i have to subtract okay now shift a1 this side so a1 plus a1 is 1 over 2 a square theta and this is twice of a1 is 1 over 2 a square theta now twice of a1 a1 is the area of the triangle right but this time we don't have angle we have angle in terms of theta only so no problem area of the triangle is 1 over 2 times product of adjacent sides and then sine theta equals 1 over 2 a square theta this 2 and 2 we can cancel ka times ka that's k square a square sine theta and here it is 1 over 2 a square theta now a square and a square we can cancel take 2 or multiply by 2 both sides so that's 2 k square sine theta equals theta now 2 k square equals theta over sine theta that's great now we got this result theta over sine theta which is greater than 1 so here we can write theta over sine theta is greater than 1 actually it is given to us now for this theta over sine theta we can replace by 2k square so here k square is greater than 1 over 2 now if k square is greater than 1 over 2 then we can use then use this result if let's use different color if x square is greater than a square then x is less than minus a or x is greater than a right so this is k square is greater than half which we can which we can write k square is greater than 1 over root 2 whole square and then we can use this result so that result will tell us k is less than minus 1 over root 2 or k is greater than 1 over root 2 so we got this possible answer however before concluding the final result we should look at our question once again in the question it's clearly mentioned k less than one first of all and k cannot be uh, you know k must be greater than zero or k cannot be negative because k is related to here you can clearly check see k a this one this is related to side if k is negative then side will be negative so k cannot be negative k should be only positive and k should be less than 1. So here, if you observe, if I conclude final answer, then please check what should be the final answer, okay? I'm going on real number line. So this is minus 1 over root 2. This is 1 over root 2. And what's, what is 1 over root 2? What's the value? 1 over root 2 is 0 0.7. Okay, so 1 will be here and 0 will be here. So please try to understand one answer which is this k is less than minus 1 over root 2 so this side and this side okay great now other condition of k which is given here which is given here k must be positive it is not given but we have to use this result k must be greater than 0 but a smaller sorry k must be greater than 0 but less than 1 because it is given less than 1 so now other answer is this 0 to 1 right now we have to look for common answer so what is the common answer this is this part is only red this is only yellow but this part is uh, red and yellow so only 1 over root 2 to 1 is that condition which is greater than 0 as well as less than 1 so finally your answer is k is greater than 1 over root 2 and less than 1 so this is your final answer okay so i believe it was a interesting question uh, i hope you liked and uh, you understood as well 
so thank you very much guys and uh, please subscribe this channel here you will learn more maths in future where i will uh, create videos based on igcse as and a level and further maths and additional maths okay guys thank you very much see you in the next video bye